All right, welcome to another crappie moment. We are fishing. Uh, it is a uh, little bit on the chilly side today. Wind's not too bad, a little bit of a breeze, like six, seven mile an hour for the wind, not too bad. Uh, the water temperature's sitting about uh, 52 degrees or so where we're at right now. I've got my seven and a half foot ACC crappie sticks. I'm using 15 pound braid. Right now I am, uh, I've got tied on a 16th ounce jig head with a two inch Bobby Garland baby shad in the blue ice color. I've got a little split shot on there. I think it's a number five, not sure. And that's an eight millimeter bead that I have. I could probably get by without that split shot. I'm fishing some shallow water right now. So I usually just put that bead on there to um, you know, help my uh, jig show up a lot better on live scope. Um, we're out here, we're fishing, we're gonna see what we can do. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, uh, hit that subscribe button for me. Hit that like button. Leave me a comment below. Let me know where you're fishing from. All my regular subscribers, really appreciate y'all watching. Appreciate all the support. Uh, thank you. Let's get out here, let's get some crappie. All right, let's get them. Right there. There it comes. There it comes. Bam! <laughs> oh yeah. There we go. There's a hoss. Oh my gosh! Now that is a massive, massive crappie. Wow. Mm -mm 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 -mm. fish beautiful full of eggs mm -mm -mm. nice that is the monster crappie right there that is a huge, huge, huge crappie. There we go. Oh. Now that is what you look for. Marked crappie right there. Massive, massive. Let's talk about the truth about March crappie. The truth about March crappie is you want to go early March. Um, that you've heard the saying when the dogwoods bloom, uh, it's a great time to go crappie fishing. And when the dogwoods bloom, you can definitely catch a lot of, of crappie. Uh, that's you know usually late March, early April, uh, a lot of crappie. But if you wait till the dogwoods bloom, you're gonna miss out on uh, a lot of quality quality fish so go early march and um you know crappie during uh, this time of year are going to be in different water depths the water temperatures are slowly gradually increasing you get to that sweet spot where that water temperature gets to be you know uh, 55 degrees uh, or so, uh, that's when those crappie are really going to start to uh, turn on. You'll see a lot more activity, um, a lot more aggression. Um, that water temperature sweet spot is going to be that 55 degrees, and then slowly as it creeps up to about 60, it's going to be a great, great time uh, for crappie fishing success uh, in March. Throw in just about any kind of bait. Um, 
You can throw uh, bobby garlands, you can throw underspins, you can throw spinners, uh, hair jigs, uh, a lot of different, because these fish are going to be more aggressive, they're going to be more likely to uh, hit um, of various types of bait and you know also you'll find crappie in different water depths um, because they are transitioning and, and, and moving from generally the deeper water that they were in uh, during the winter time and transitioning to that shallower water you'll find uh, crappie uh, in, in various water depths you'll find them in 25 feet of water you'll find them in uh, 20 15 feet of water I'm fishing in 10 11 12 feet of water today and and these crappie are just uh, hitting uh, these these jigs are very very aggressive having a lot of success today uh, so you can find them uh, in the deeper water depths but higher up in the water column so if you're fishing 20 25 feet of water you can fish higher up in the water column where they're only three four feet down from the surface I've caught several fish today where I'm fishing in 12 feet of water depth, uh, and, but these fish are like two feet from the surface. They're, they're like two, three feet down from the surface. They're up uh, higher in the water column. So um, uh, go out there, get you some crappie. Uh, don't wait. Uh, throw of various uh, types of, of, of baits will work a and you'll find them in varying various water depths um, You know, I I, I like fishing uh, this time of year where I'm at, you know that 10 15 foot range of water depth And then as the water temperature starts to uh, gradually increase a little bit deeper uh, Higher than you know, I I'm gonna go a little bit shallower than you know that 10 to 15 feet All right, let's get out here and get some more crappie There we go. Gave it a second look. What a monster. Mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, my soul. Ah, there we go. There we are. Gave it a second look. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Beautiful. Quality fish. Mm. Ha, did y'all see that? I hope I got that on live scope. I hope I can get you some good footage. Very aggressive. That thing hit the water. He saw it. And he just came and popped it. Mm 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 mm. -mm. There he comes. There, bam. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Sitting right at the top of that tree. Oh, yeah. Beautiful fish. Oh, there it is. 
Nice white crappie. Nice white crappie right there. Catching them pigs today. Top of the water column. Oh wow, that is in there. There we go, beautiful, beautiful fish. belly beautiful fish today had a great great time my goodness caught some monster monster crappie that pre-spawn is on the fish are moving don't forget don't wait till late march go early march early march remember that these fish are going to be more aggressive than what they have been uh, various types of bait spinners uh, bobby garlands charlie brewers hair jigs great great choices they're going to be more aggressive so they're going to be more likely to hit all types of baits and you know they're going to be in varying water depths yes they're going to be you know in moving shallower but you can still catch them in that you know 20 25 foot range but higher up in the water column go out there get you some crappie if you haven't done so hit that subscribe button for me smash that like button leave me a comment let me know where you're fishing from and uh we will see y'all next time <laughs>